<laughs> you ready to play a game on the GameCube? I'm ready to play a game on the We can play many games. We can play uh, NBA. We can play Star Fox. Dude, I can't. Look, Star can Fox, play... look at him. Look at him. Listen to him. He says, nah, no. No, he doesn't do want it. to. Just that's please fine. don't do it. Uh, we can play Spet. We can play. Do you think that was intentional? Holy shit. That he's just saying, that no, he's stay just away. going, no, no. Yeah, probably. <laughs> we could play my favorite game ever, though. The absolute yeah. 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 And its sequel. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Let's go to that one. Fuck so Everybody knows. Let us know. I'm so excited. Oh my god. I'm so excited. It's happening! <laughs> we promised. Did we deliver? Eventually. Oh, yeah, that's us. We deliver eventually. Alright, I'm just. just we're at moment innocent. silence here. Oh, well, not that's quite right. Yet. Yeah, a little, little. Thanks for that. But. <laughs> Hot. Fuck! Uh, it still says Killer 8. Well, because my memory card's in there, which has the clear data. Yeah, that's true. That's alright. Whatever. Okay. It ruined our it ruined our intro a little bit, but that's okay. Killer Hop. Oh, it's Hopper, Hopper 7! 7. <laughs> yes. So, uh, uh, just go up to Killer 7. And anyway. Uh, look at this! It's the game Welcome to Killer, Killer 7! 7. <laughs> that we've never played before. Just kidding. We've played extensively. We've played this a lot. Oh my god, I am so pumped. Oh. This game confused and scared and delighted the little high school Dan when it came out in 2005. Little baby high school Do Dan. Do it. Uh... Okay. Alright, what are we doing? You're gonna do normal or deadly? Uh, like... Deadly is a fucking slog, I gotta admit. Like, Yeah, because all it does is just like... I don't know. Cause it, like, it limits your blood files, and oh, really? you know what? Yeah, it's uh, it makes it a grind fest, is what it is. Oh, and that sucks. I'm I'm not into that. Like, yeah, because because bloodbath is one thing. Like that that is shit is fucking fuck. amazing. Oh my god, that's just, that's really hard. Basically, it's a mode of the game that you unlock after you beat it, where almost everything is a one hit kill. Or, no, or, or they're just really your enemies are strong and weak points are hidden. All the weak points that you have to shoot to like kill them without wasting a ton of bullets are hidden. Uh, you'll see as we Wasting go on. If you remember. Yeah. All right. Here we go. <laughs> as if that's a factor in this. Yeah. Here we go. Where I'm gonna get the hands. Get I think the hands. That's, that's pretty. Uh... <sighs> I'm gonna, you're gonna hear this noise from me a lot it's, during the course of this game. It's gonna be a lot of heavy breathing, a lot of just some noises that maybe you don't understand. Hey, it's Moonlight Syndrome. This is not a pseudo game without involving the moon somehow. It truly is not. At least in fucking Killer is Dead, they just bit the bullet and went on the moon. Yeah. Even though the game was not that good. Not great. <laughs> game makes me sad, but Carson. we're not talking about that. We're talking about this. It was the best fucking about... thing Studio 51 ever made. Ugh. Just look at, like, this was so different from any, like, video game that I had, that anybody had ever fucking played. I love this so much. Oh shit! Chris Mills. This is mouth. Oh, I love the mouth of Mills. <laughs> Such a great sequence. Look at these fucking gradients. We're just like, okay. Honestly, after playing the first level of this game, I had kind of a weird state for about like a half hour or so, where I wasn't exactly sure if everything was real. Really? Like just because it threw my senses so much, it where feels I was just so like, oh, dreamlike. I was very jarred. Yeah. And. Uh, you know what, actually, like, okay, this is somewhat off topic, but, like, I'm realizing now that a lot of the reason why... Are you there yet? You mean this shit old? That's where they all hang out. Our information tells us that there's 14 of them. And they're all fun. <laughs> nah, I keep one alive so we can ask who their boss is. Anything else I should know? Nah, not really. You'll know when you see them, they're, uh... Different. Different. <laughs> we'll do May the Lord smile. And the devil have mercy. Devil have mercy. Oh. Oh. oh my god. Man, I crushed so hard on Garcia. And How could you crush not? Past tense. Fuck you. Oh, I'm just gay and I want. Oh. The fucking 
presentation. Of we're gonna this be shit. we're gonna end up having going silent a lot because oh. everything about this game is the coolest thing ever. Yeah, I'm sorry, this game cut you off. What, what were you saying? D do you need the controls? Oh, you know fucking this game? No. I know. Oh, I look at even this. Like, look at that. That's so cool. Yeah. But um, what I'm realizing is that like this style, like I feel like what's part of what's getting me so pumped about No Man's Sky mm -hmm. is that it looks a bit like this. Really? Like it's it's definitely more detailed, but in terms of gradients, color scheme, and like general detail of everything, it looks like a higher res version of this. <laughs> Interesting. And like honest, I'm so fucking. It's day that boy. Game. I, 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 oh, oh. You don't want to go any further. My friends Ugh. are all dead. dead. They're all, they were all dead. murdered by people that look like, look like this. I have been chosen. <laughs> I don't know why we've bothered sinking this. Game. Yeah. <laughs> we'll have periodic moments where the dialogue and us will just sink up. Hmm. Those bastards are breeding. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. I love Dan Smith. Day I, boy. I didn't like him much when I first started playing, but once you get him upgraded a bit, he's actually very good. He's so good. I, I love him. So, who's Real? your main? Um, my main was Khan. Yeah. Um, okay, well, maybe we should explain a little bit for people who have no idea just, what the fuck this game is. Because we did skip the controls, just so you know. So, uh, to move forward, you press the A button. Yeah. Um, to turn around, you press B. You're on rails. You guys do the quick turn. Do the quick turn. You do the quick? Do the oh, quick, it's not that quick. Cool. It's not Khan's a good great. place for it. Kevin's is the best. Yeah. Um, and you hold a direction on the analog stick, and then you just move forward with A to go in that direction. Yeah. It's so fucking different. That's just movement. And also- then, And then shooting is, is basically like, you go in first person for it. Yeah, you go into- You go into first person. Are you freeze, you just bang, 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 bang. And I, let me just say that I think flicking the C stick in any direction to reload is one of the most satisfying controls in yeah. the game. I, I love it. You just like flick your thumb to the side and it's just like, I'm ready, let's do this. Feels ready. Um, also you have- ready? What the fuck does that mean? But also- You have so many personalities to choose from. Not just Dan Smith, you I have- I forgot Connors from the Coyote side. Coyote Smith. Pretty badass. Coyote Smith, the kind guy who <laughs> uh, the guy who everybody felt bad with and just had to bring along anyway. Yeah. And Con My Fox man. Smith. Yeah, so it Con's you're still your main? Oh yeah, the speedy boy. Love him. Speedy Gonzalez. I I would cosplay him if I wasn't so not ripped. <laughs> and tiny. <laughs> Yeah. He's ripped, tiny, and blind. Ripped, tiny, and blind. Also, he's like 16. Yeah, he is. He's like 16 or 17. Later. <laughs> Peace. Oh, hello. Vincel Dil Boris. He was Aru Scoff. I always forget That's his a name. full name. <laughs> he was Aru. Oh, so, you're great. here's the thing about this guy he talks. Oh, does he talk? <laughs> it's a, like, I remember reading. Why they put this weird filter on this so you can't understand it. Because every once in a while you can hear it, and it's very, incredibly broken English. Yeah. Because this game, in Japan, had a full English dub. This game is a lot about... It's very much about relations between the East and the West. Yeah. Um, and so this game had a full English dub, but the voice actors that they got weren't really great at English. Yeah, but what so. it ended up doing was giving the game more character than anything. Cause like, because honestly, those like affected vocal samples are so much of why this game is so cool. Oh yeah. Um. God, I'm gonna turn on my TV. Yeah. Did we confirm that if you don't turn on a TV, then you, that like whatever Harmon's room you turn on a TV is where you just wait. I don't know. Yeah. Um, because I think that might have just been a superstition I made up because I did that about But it makes games. sense, and I do it anyway because it feels right, and I think it's true. I think I did test it at one point. Um, so yeah, you can also wake up other people. You gotta uh, defeat But it. you have to kill enemies to do that. I'm so, so happy we're playing this. I haven't even, like, seen this game in years, and I'm yeah. just, I'm so fucking... You can go forward over here. He's got a little bestiary going on. Doesn't yeah, really matter. Well, it's, a, it's not really a bestiary so much as it's, like, a techniques thing. No, he'll, he'll tell you about different enemies, too. Does he? I think. Wow. I never did that. Yeah. Um, I mean... You know what, it's really not what I'm realizing important. is that there's so many parts of this game and so many, like, elements that I've just seen so many times that they're normalized to me now. Yeah. But, like, I, I can't even imagine what it's like to just see this game for the first time. Yeah, so you, you have to scan for them yeah, to reveal they're... them because they're invisible at first. And you see that little glowing spot right over there? You can just shoot them anywhere, but to get a one-hit kill... You can do that. You not miss. That's why I don't like oh. Han so much, because he's really close. Cool. But I, mean, I, I are, like spray and pray. Yeah, these are level ones, though. But Kevin is always my boy. Yeah. What you gotta say to me? Can I uh, let me be honest about something? Though? What? 
is that we this game has been part of our lives for for so long that the reason why I started the game playing as Kevin is because he doesn't say anything when you get a weak spot kill. So if our parents were around and they heard like <gasps> them all saying fuck, they is wouldn't have let why? me Yeah, that's why but then, oh my God. then Kevin ended up just being my favorite character, yeah. like outside of that. But yeah, that is why. <laughs> Kevin is also great and in some literature about the game he's he's gay. Oh, but wait. like there it's it's pretty much this one thing called Hand and Killer Seven, which I figured that was what you were talking about. Yeah. There are it reveals a lot of extra plot details, but a lot of them also conflict. Mm, nice. There we go. There it is. First one of the game. Yeah, they also like conflict with a lot of the stuff said in the game, so nobody's really sure what's canon and what isn't in that. So yeah, I... here we go. Ugh. Quick turn. Quick turn. Ugh. Quick turn. Yeah. Wait, show up Khan's reload, because it's cool shit. Oh yeah. He does the he like fucking hacky sacks his <laughs> <laughs> bullets. In. Oh yeah, Khan's big on the sack, man. He's just fucking kicking it, kicking it hard. See, Travis, Travis Bell. That's his last name. Bell. Okay. Um, because I remember when when like No More Heroes started coming out, and it was like, what's the main character's name? Travis. What? Was like, <laughs> was that Travis before he died? No, it's no, a it's not. Different <laughs> it's a different Travis. Although thing. Garcia and Smith, kind of is in No More Heroes. Is he? Yeah, the very end. Which, um, by the way, we should play No More Heroes as well. Oh, yeah, well... Can we just go on a suit kick for a while? I really need this. Again, I, absolutely, totally. I really need this. Um, uh, at the very end, right before the final, final boss, like, um... Uh, Travis Touchdown is... He's one. He's at he's at number one spot. Yeah. Hi, Kikazaru. Kikazaru. Um, I like Kikazaru. Kikazaru's got a bullet fetish. She you can sure pick does. up on that. Um, oh, he does. I'm sorry. I missed whoever. Kikazaru. I feel like the remnant psyches are... I always thought Kikazaru was a girl. Well, um, there's another Zaru. Yeah, who... that's what I'm thinking of, maybe. Oh, is that the one who points? The one who's uh, Kaede's BFF. Right. Yeah. The one who she slits her wrists and, and unlocks doors. Yeah. Man, whenever you say things about this game aloud, you start to realize, like, what the fuck is happening? <laughs> like, yeah, real quick, like, Travis is, like, on the toilet, and he's just taking a shit, and a uh, Garcian lookalike with, this, with Greg Eagles voicing him oh. comes in with a beam saber and either cuts him down and kills him, or if you've got the true end, oh, familiar. then you can beat him and the Irish boy, like, friends him. Right. Oh, that's cool. I forgot, like... White with red on it is that a, is that the mark of like a traitor? Yeah. Okay. At least as far as that's, that's in this as, game like, anyway. This game. I don't know if that's anything outside of this game. It's very but inferred. It makes sense with Camellia, and then it raises questions about Kaede. I mean, a lot of the things that I know about this game are things that people inferred and like theories that I read. Yeah, but I kind of so, like that. You can kind of take that with a grain of salt. Also, red on white, Japanese flag. So it truly is. Yeah, yeah. truly. You raise an excellent and cogent point there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Alright, so... So, we'll a, see. There's some big wavies. Right? Yeah, the big wavy, and the wavies... We'll need a big Dan. Video games with Dan Smith. That's right, it's on brand. It sure is. Alright. Okay, see, that's so shit, that's bad. It's, that's gonna, drop bad it's gonna drop eggs. It's gonna drop eggs. Alright. Camellia Smiles also oh, give you a lot of... This is where position fetish came from. <laughs> um... Anyway. <laughs> anyway, moving on from that, uh, chameleon smells are weird. You basically you just have to like you have to kill them before they run into a wall and explode, and then you get a bunch of blood. Blood is an interesting mechanic in this game too, because like you get you get blood by shooting weak points to kill. Mm -hmm. Um, but blood vials are to heal and to use Dan's power, and then you also use blood to, well, to level up. Um, power blood powers are used for all characters. It's true. I, they I have blood I powers. only think about Dan's. <laughs> Yeah. Just because, like, that's, that's the too, one that you, you actually need more often. Uh, no kid. That's the collateral. Oh, thing. but it dropped the fucking... No, it use dropped the pause! Anyway. Use the pause glitch! What's the pause glitch? If you pause on here, um, like, the explosion animation finishes, but the monster yeah, stops moving. Yeah, that's right! So you could just, you can just do it. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's true, I forgot about that. Yeah. Bad girl! Foreshadowing. That. Bad girl. Foreshadowing for, like... <laughs> Four years from this, when, yeah. he, when he made No More Heroes. We fitted a clamp down. I think we know too much about this game. <laughs> <laughs> this is great. We can just, like, fangirl all over this fucking oh, game. Oh, fuck yeah. Oh, God. Hey, Smith. I'm so happy. Yeah, it is. Purportedly. 
Because I love how cold this game throws you in for this mission. Oh yeah, it's and just it, like you just gotta kill them. There's, it gives it's you a context, cell, kind of. It gives you context after in episode two, mm -hmm. but it's also very kind of nebulous. Hey. I mean, this whole game never really holds your hand about anything, and, yeah, and that's what I really love about it, is that it's, it's genuinely mysterious, but it's so interesting, you just want to know everything about it. Also, fucking stylish out there, like, this is what really started me as, like, a style junkie in video games, same. it's just like, yeah. Yeah, same. All the crazy shit you can do, like, the, the fucking, that weird little you got thing with just weird little border, just a paragraph marker on it. Yeah. I don't know. It Everything. makes no sense. Even the loading screens are interesting. Like, they, they, every single opportunity that they had to, to make it look like its own thing, they took. And it's, oh god, this game's the best fucking game. There, <laughs> there it is. There we go. There we go. I'm just so worried that, like, when we're bantering, I'll miss a chuckle and then I'll die. <laughs> yeah, that's likely. <laughs> Because, actually, the way that this game is played best is alone at night in, in complete silence. Yeah. Because when you do that, and especially there's certain environments that are really fucking creepy, mm -hmm. this game is good. I love his little sayings. We're in a tight spot. <laughs> oh, damn. Tight spot. Life is... Well, that's nice, I guess. Uh, oh, Heaven's Final is the name of the enemies. Yeah. The, that's that's the things. And they're basically... We haven't really seen this, but they're bombs. Yeah, they're walking suicide bombs. Yeah. Um, That people can get turned into, but also can be, like, made? I was never super clear on that. It's... I don't think... It's purposely kind of obtuse, and yeah. I love it. Well, is it something to do with Kung Lan? Because, like, I, I, he's Kung got, Lan. like, a weird hand thing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Great sequence here. Kuman's <laughs> voice actor also recorded all of the laughters, as far as I'm aware. Yeah, which is insane. Cause, damn, they're amazing. They're really good. <laughs> uh, hey, there you are. Oh, there's golden. <laughs> now. I forget if the golds ever, like, give you any extra. They do. Shit, I'm still banned. If you, uh... Um, yeah, that's why they, that's why they blow up, because if you, if you kill them, then you get a, you get, like, a ton. Oh, okay, so it's a similar deal to the Camellia Smile. It's been a while. Yeah, so it actually comes towards you instead of, uh, yeah. running away from you. I think there's only four in there, sir. Yeah. There's parts of this game that I know exceedingly well. <laughs> like, this, um, yeah. a lot of, uh, fucking, what's his name? Hey. You know who I'm thinking of? Who? Afro. Oh, Andre Almeida. Yeah, yeah. a lot of Almeida Land or, or whatever it was actually called. Like I know so, cool. so well, and it's so good. Uh, it was the only time that I've seen Texan dystopia. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and it's so good. All right, wake up, Kevin. Kev. The boy. He's so Later. good. He's my favorite. You never have to reload with him. Later. Yeah, he always just has throwing knives. Wait. He always the thing. He's he's throwing knives, no waiver, and no reloading. So, you collect thick blood, which is different from the blood vials. Yeah. You can compress them into serum to upgrade your dudes. Yeah, which, like, the level stuff carries over between levels. Mm -hmm. Um, but there's also a blood limit per level. Yeah. So you can't really, like, you can't grind. So this is not a thing, because eventually the blood room just breaks down. <laughs> yep. So I'm going to show some obvious favoritism. Yeah, dude. And, uh, upgrade his power. I would say way His... Yeah, his way That's a good point. Honestly, the way that I played this game is I got, like, I would go in order of favorite characters, all level ones. Mm -hmm. So I would just, I would, like, I would level pretty evenly. That's probably what I'd end up doing. Also, Kevin Smith has no waiver, which is great. Yeah, so there's no need for that. Also, Kevin Smith, no relation to the famous film director. In none. Um... I think oh, if you level criticals up, are important. Yeah, if you level up criticals, I think that's what gives you, um, critical lock. The drop kill, and yeah. Um... <coughs> And I'll uh, thinking about what we're saying in the context of other people who are going to be listening and not understanding us is kind of funny. It's <laughs> just like, oh, we're getting super fucking technical. Yeah, you go really? unlock an ability later on where you basically, as soon as you scan, you lock onto their weak point. Yeah, which is pretty great. It is, and it also the moment that you unlock it, especially for Kevin, it makes bloodbath almost trivial because oh, it still yeah, works. That's true. You still have the critical lock even though you can't see it. Yeah, but before that, you just have to you just have to know because it's either at the neck, one of the arms, or one of the thighs, and like that's just it. You just need to know where they are and try to. Um, the other thing that I only um, one spawns in front when you come out of the room. Yeah. 
the, the other thing um, with Harmon's rooms is that, as you just saw, the light was on, which means I can't save. If the light is off and Samantha's dressed in her maid outfit, then she can save. <laughs> yeah. But if Samantha's dressed casually and posing provocatively... Yeah, obviously. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, come on, then. <laughs> Let's... All right, I'm going to do this just for posterity. I'm going to do this just for posterity. Yeah. Switch to the blind man. Because this enemy blinds you. Yeah. And it still works. I don't like the micro smile, honestly. Yeah, it's just a I think it's a weird concept that, like, it, it could have worked here. It wasn't. They didn't really use it well. Con is so inaccurate. It don't matter. It do matter. You need that blood. You shot off a weak yeah, point. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> you got your shit! <laughs> Alright, go get blind. Yeah. Yeah, you gotta pull it. You just it. Ah, I just killed it. Whatever. I don't give a fuck. That's fine. I don't care. <laughs> you think I care? I don't care. You think you care about showing off things? Nah. Oh, there he is. There he is. He's running. Oh, the runner. I fucking hate those. Wait, wait, wait listen. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. This game isn't fast. He's such a little team. Oh, oh, this is the scene I was thinking of. Yeah, this is the one. Uh, you gotta help me. Yeesh! Thanks. You're gonna wanna get that checked out. <laughs> That's gonna leave a, a, la a back. <laughs> <laughs> Honey, you need a new spine. <laughs> okay. One thing is, I did tend to get lost in, in this area a little in bit. In the opening area? Yeah. I also get lost in here. <laughs> oh, hi. I, I, like, uh, what I used to do is I, I always would kind of over the hit. Like, it's actually easier than I think it is, but it doesn't need to switch to Kevin. This guy, this <laughs> yeah. guy ridiculous. Yeah, you can switch to Kevin and get some actual, like, get some... You got a stew going. <laughs> Check this out. Yeah, it goes... Woo! Yeah! Woohoo! <laughs> Woohoo! Alright, let's Kevin talk to Yoon Hyunin. No! Just once. Just once. He's the guy who will give you solutions to the incredibly easy puzzles that we'll see in a moment. Incredibly easy puzzles. <laughs> I'm a shiver. A good man. But good man, yes. Good Thank you boy. much gratitude. This dude is fucking weird. He's well, cause he's he's pretty nice. Um, but you shoot the mask and he literally he flips you off. Yeah. And insults you for asking for another hint. And he puts on the mask and he yeah. takes blood in order for a hint. Yeah. Like I, and Christ, like you don't need these hints. These puzzles are not it's hard. So far, yeah, yeah. Quick question. And use this Do you mask. remember the order of the horses in the horse puzzle? Uh, 143765. Thank you, so do I. <laughs> God. That'll come back later. Uh, honestly, like, later on, I want to just double check that Less and just luck. do the puzzle Faker. without looking at the, the poster. Oh, yeah. Do you see the puzzle or the poster first? I don't remember. You see the puzzle first, so So, yeah, 143765. Sounds good. So, room 212. Here we are. What a what? fantastic candelabra. Dude, I... Let me tell you. I They're numbered! I don't know how to do this. What do we do? Find out next time... On video on games. On video games. It's finally fucking happening. We're playing Killer7. We're doing it. Time to turn on some air. Cool. <sighs> Alright, that was two sign-offs. You want to do another one? Yeah. Um, uh, she gonna check you later! <laughs> That's good. Three? Alright. I'm wishing you a big happy morning over at the video game's house. <laughs> <laughs> See ya. <laughs> Fucking bye. Good land. There he is. <laughs> <laughs>